Hi, I'm going to show you what the process is in restoring a cracked and damaged tennis court and doing all the work required in resurfacing it to finally restore the tennis court and actually make it far better than it ever was before. The following video highlights the many crucial steps that must be taken in order to create an ideal tennis court. In order to remove any mildew or loose debris, the court will be pressure cleaned using at least a 2500 PSI pressure cleaner. Raised cracks or raised areas will be machine sanded or grinded to assure a smooth surface. Any cracks that are greater than 1 16th of an inch in width will be filled with an acrylic crack filler. Low areas where water accumulates, otherwise known as bird baths, will be patched and leveled to be within the United States Tennis Association standards. For more damaged or heavily damaged and cracked tennis courts, a fiberglass membrane that is designed especially for tennis court resurfacing is installed using an acrylic resurfacer that bonds the membrane to the existing court. A second coat of acrylic resurfacer is applied over the fiberglass membrane. Two acrylic color coats are applied to the inbounds and out of bounds areas, giving the tennis court a completely brand new look. If a two-tone color for the court is desired, measurements are then taken to divide the inbounds playing area from the perimeter. Measurements are taken to restripe the tennis court according to the United States Tennis Association standards. Using a tape machine, the playing lines are taped out. The white lines are painted by hand with an acrylic textured line paint.
The tennis net is reinstalled and now you're ready to swing that racket and enjoy one of the best sports in the world. I'm Maya Parrots for Landslot Tennis. Thank you for watching.